As mentioned, Bob Chorp is a pub located slightly off the quayside on a street called Sandhill. Robert Chorp was an architect who designed and built this structure. It was built around the same time as Bessie Surfy, residents implying that the pub was constructed to be a home. The house was built in a typical Tudor Jacobean style that had a large impact on the exterior aesthetics of the pub. The mullion and transom windows have been hailed as some of the best examples of the time. Robert Chollop had designed several buildings around Newcastle, one of the most famous being the Guildhall opposite Bob Chollop. Here you can see the variants and styles used by the architect. Similarities to Bob Chollop include using locally sourced materials. Here it is the limestone that is taken from the local quarries. The pub is situated in an architecturally diverse part of Newcastle containing modern popular bars as well as traditional public houses. On the Gateshead side of the river there is the Baltic, an ex-flower mill turned into a contemporary arts gallery, and the Sage, a popular concert hall and musical educational facility designed by Lord Norman Foster. The Tyne Bridge constructed is a fine example of the compression arch suspension deck bridge that spans 161.8 metres across the river. Another of the Tyne's attractions is the award-winning Millennium Bridge which is an elegantly designed tilt bridge for pedestrians and cyclists. These structural marvels make the River Tyne a popular tourist attraction. The river itself was most likely utilised for the transport of construction materials transported for further afield. It may have also been used as a more economical way of transporting a large batch of materials that have been locally produced. The advance in logistics today means materials can be transported safely and quickly from literally any of the corner of the world. Splendid! 